Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial we are going to learn about uh, enabling and disabling users in our application. So first I will come to this uh, uh, SQL Server Management Studio and here we will uh, modify our uh, users table and I will add here is active and it will be a bit value and for now I will allow null I will control S it now we will uh, modify the values as well so I will design go to design not design but I will uh, edit up 200 rows now here our value is not added uh, or column so if I check the design again uh, we design is active is uh, there so I'll control is it and now if I right click on this and select edit top 200 rows it is again showing this I'll close this close this as well this and I'll uh, refresh the DBs and now I'll again uh, edit top 200 rows now it is showing up so I'll use uh, one here and uh, I'll add another record here and it will be MIK and password is MIK as well and we will uh, put in zero here and I'll press tab so now this is false deactivated so now uh, we will go to our code uh, not our code but we will go to our uh, store procedures and I will modify this uh, uh, get user credential store procedure modify this so first we will add here the output uh, parameter that it will out uh, here I'll come put a comma and here we will use at uh, is active and use small and uh, this is a bit type and uh, I'll use output and here instead of comma I use uh, a small now here we will set this to zero so uh, set add is uh, active equals zero and now I'll copy this this one up to here I'll control C this and now I'll make some space here and I'll use uh, here control V and uh, I'll use begin and then I will use end and here we will code so now we will use here as uh, uh, I'll add in the uh, column uh, here as well so I'll go to the end of this query and we will use and is active equal to at uh, is active this one and now I'll use here these three I'll control C this I'll control V it here and uh, now I'll set this a bit this one as well now I'll make this one this one and this one as well and here we will use else
else and now we will uh, get this code now this is good now we will execute this I will set this code a bit so I'll go above and this is good so now I'll set this I'll give it a, a tab and uh, uh, a tab to this as well and now I'll select this all and give it a tab now the code is uh, good now I'll execute it again so successfully executed now we will go to our uh, code and we will add in the these values here as well so i'll go to our login i'll double click on this and first we will uh, add here our parameter so uh, out out is active and now we will create this uh, down and here we will also use it here but we will use it uh, later first we will go down to our this uh, method and if I close this and close this as well so that all our code is available to us and first we will uh, declare it here so I'll declare it here uh, out ball and is active and now we will uh, get it here into these parameters uh, I'll copy this one Control C this I'll go to the end of this I'll enter and control V this and um, I'll change only the parameter here uh, is uh, active small and now I'll put semicolon at the end I'll put semicolon here now the error is gone now we will get is um, active here so we haven't created I think this uh, at the top so we will go and create this as well right here um, here comma is active and now we will get here and we will use as active and we will use it here and ball and cmd dot parameters para meters and now we will pass in here the at is active and now we will use dot value dot value and it will be capital and semicolon now we get uh, the is active value now we will go on top and uh, we will uh, apply the conditions I will come here I will come here inside this and I will use if is active and I will use this and I will remove this one and I will use it uh, here and then we will use else message box dot show 
on message but message box dot show and in here it will take a message so the message will be um, user disable disabled and then comma uh, warning and then comma message box button dot ok comma message uh, box uh, box icon dot um, information and now I'll put semicolon here now our code is complete now let's check it now if I run this and now if I enter here admin 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 which is active and if I log in this user disabled it should uh, user disabled for this one as well so if I close this and if I go here and check what is the problem So I think we do not have any problem in our code. We have the problem in our store procedure. So if I go here and get this user credential and execute this store procedure, and if I provide here the value admin and admin here as well, so it will. Uh, we will check if what out parameter it is giving us. Now it is. Uh, giving a at username as uh, password one and as active zero but if we look at the table here as active is one so let's modify the store procedure and check it if we have any problem here so now I'll come here to store procedure and select our first uh, query so first one it username and as active is as active so we have a problem with our store procedure we haven't uh, given the as active uh, value so here we will provide the as active value uh, we have provided this uh, out parameter here if we see this as uh, out parameter here we will provide this is active one and now we will modify and modify our uh, store procedure and now we will check our code if it is working now I'll go here and now if we run this and now if I use admin here and if I log in this now it is working now if I close it down and uh, stop this and rerun this and what other other user we have given if I come here and if I check this uh, select uh, top 1000 rows the other user is MIK MIK now if I go here to this and if I remove this M I and if I M I K and now if I use here M I K and now if I log in this user disabled so this user is disabled so I think that's all part today I hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you